Hey guys, welcome back to Brunson's Math Club. Today's topic is what are alternate interior angles? Alternate interior angles are angles that are the opposite angles on the inside of the two lines that are being crossed by a transversal line. So what I mean by that is here we have a transversal line, which is the blue line, and it is crossing over two lines, right? And the alternate interior angles would be the angles that are opposite and they're inside the two lines. So let's just um, uh, note all the angles here that are forming. So we have angle number one, angle number two, angle number three, angle number four, and then we have angle number five, angle number six, angle number seven, and angle number eight. Now the interior angles are the angles inside of the two lines, which are angles 3, 4, 5, and 6. Now the alternate interior angles will be the angles that are opposite and inside the two lines. So angles 3 and 6 are alternate interior angles because they're inside the two lines, okay, and they're opposite. So these are alternate interior angles. In the same way, angles 4 and 5 are also alternate interior angles because they're inside the two lines and they're opposite, okay? So these are alternate interior angles. And remember, no angle that is, um, a a any angle that's outside the two lines would not be alternate interior angles. Those would be alternate exterior angles, and we describe those in another video. So thanks for watching this video and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.